lockdown last year. We've tried our hardest to put a smile on your face every day. And it's fair to say that one other team has gone above and beyond to do just that. We could fill a whole show with Josie Gibson's standout moments, along with Alison Hammond's as well. How lucky are we to have I both know. of them? Uh, so it's Josie today. Here are just a few of our favourites. Since Josie joined this morning back in 2019, she's done some pretty amazing things. I'm down at Q Little Pigs in, Am <laughs> in Amersham, where I also just got bit by a pig. She's been to Africa on safari. It was fantastic. Rode with huskies in Lapland. <laughs> and even climbed five mountains in five days. Just look at this drop. I've got to get down from here. But what really sticks out in our minds are those times when things haven't quite gone to plan. <laughs> oh, <laughs> start again. Josie's always been known for her serious news journalism. I am at the iconic Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Like back in July when she was reporting on theme parks reopening after lockdown. I'll tell you what, I haven't had a ride for such a long time. Um, it's about time I got the adrenaline pumping, actually. <laughs> I'm not sure she's enjoying this. <laughs> oh, God, where am I? You're definitely on a roller coaster. Now pull your mask down. That's better. <laughs> and from one ride to another, Josie is always a consummate professional. How are you going to protect the public safety? Oh! So all of our guests are going to have to play that. <laughs> Sorry, son. I'm the marvelous. And from the dizzying heights of roller coasters to the even dizzier heights of the UK's longest zip line, Josie's always up for a challenge. No, I don't want to do it. Oh, I, I don't want to do it. Or maybe not. I'm going to faint, <laughs> Eric. I'm going to faint. Oh, you'll be fine. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> hmm, maybe I spoke too soon. <laughs> for giving me the opportunity to do that. You're welcome, Josie, and you did that with such grace. Back in 2019, she was quite literally dipping her toe in the water presenting a competition in Italy. Here's all the details while I just try and get off this. Oh, no, guys, no, no, seriously, guys, guys, guys! <laughs> Let's just check to see yeah. if she's OK. Sorry about that. They, they keep putting me on all these adventures. It's giving me grey hair. The guy with the accordion, clearly not bothered. Josie's always got her finger on the pulse, or lack thereof, when it comes to the topical news stories, like the time we sent her ghost hunting in Somerset. But apparently there is a ghoul out there who's not quite a foul man. <laughs> Get back behind that. Yeah, she's wrecked that. She's wrecked that. Josie Gibson is in Quantock Hills near Bridgewater in Somerset. Where is she? <laughs> you can come out. Good morning, Phil. Good morning, Holly. I'm down in the Quantock Hills of Somerset on the hunt for a very naughty ghoul because, quite frankly, I ain't afraid of no goose. But in true Josie style... It, you've got a little split there. Did that happen? Was that was sort of some overzealous ghost busting, maybe? What happened? I was um, filling up the car in the petrol station and I had a little accident and it, it was a bit tight. You filled up the car <laughs> dressed like that? <laughs> I think she did. I... Oh, look now. Oh, no. Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> we'll leave it. Ah, Josie, we love you, but maybe stick to the day job. Oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> she's, well a, she's just one of those people where disaster finds her. Yes. Do you know what I mean? In the most simplest of places. Yep. If it's going to go wrong, oh, it's going to go wrong for Josie. Just it's amazing. Moments. I love Thank her. you for those.